breaking news! Orc Cloud, new footage! I... <laughs> wah, 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 wah. Yeah. <laughs> What's next? Saturn. Jupiter. Saturn. Jupiter. Saturn. Good job. Earth. We can say that it is a water planet since water covers 70% of the Earth's surface. In 1999, our moon was found to have a neutral sodium tail like a comet. Jupiter. <laughs> Beetlejuice. Yeah. Oh, man. Ah. Hello. Hello. Sagittarius A. Oh no. <laughs> that doesn't look good. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Well, that happened fast. Eh. Uh, Mercury. Earth. Mercury. What goes here? Earth. Mercury. Earth. Mercury. Earth. Good job. Is it a comet? Is it an asteroid? I think it's a dinosaur. I think it's a cheese ball. A marble. <laughs> what do you think? What do you think? Ba, 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 ba. Asteroid. Good job. Yes. Sun. Rigel. Beetlejuice. You are scooting. Stevens on 2-18. A comet has several parts that we can see. There are different explanations about what these parts are. 
In the standard model, the core of a comet is said to be a giant dirty snowball. This core is called the nucleus, and it can be as big as a town. What color is T-Rex? Hmm? Yellow. 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 When the snowball comes closer to the sun, it starts to melt and evaporate water, which creates a big cloud around the snowball called the coma. The coma can change its size and can be bigger than a planet. As the comet moves, the steam and dust from the coma flies behind the comet and creates tails. Mercury. It's the smallest planet in our solar system and the closest to the sun. If you lived on Mercury, you'd have a birthday every three months. Jupiter. Sun. What's next? Jupiter. Sun. Jupiter. Sun. Jupiter. Good job. Is it an asteroid? Is it a comet? Oh, I think it might be a pterodactyl. A cheese bargain. <laughs> oh, oh, cheese oh. bargain. That looks Plank. more like a potato chip. What do you think? Comet. Oh yeah, good job! Venus. Venus is similar in size to Earth, just a little smaller. It's so hot on Venus that metals like lead would be puddles of melted liquid. Hello? Hello. Are you a cat? No, this is a cat. Are you a rat? No, this is a rat. Are you a bat? No, this is a bat. Are you a hat? No, this is a hat. Are you a man? No. I know. Are you a star? Yes. I am a star. Good job. You hold a snowball in your hand, and let's say that is the comet's core. The snowball starts to evaporate and creates a big cloud and tail. You stand in the center of the cloud. And it's so big that it can fit 50 kids on your left side, 50 kids on your right side, 50 kids on your head, and 50 kids under your feet. Hmm? From this cloud comes the tail, and it's so long that you have to drive for 20 minutes to find the end of it. Hmm? And on top of all that, the snowball keeps evaporating for years. Hmm? How much water can melt from one snowball? not get too far ahead of ourselves because the electric model on the other hand says that the solid core of a comet is rock. Imagine this rock is a starship that has shields which get stronger the longer it is away from the sun. 
when the comet comes closer to the sun. Ray shields! Now, hang on a minute. How can a comet do this? What? Iris. Huh? Huh? What? Is this whole universe mine? Yeah, it is mine. Like and subscribe. Gas science! <laughs>